Our program focuses on biomedical sciences. That involves everything from research to genetics to life science, and it also goes into human body studies. At the middle school level, we try to give kids a taste of the broad field of science, especially when it comes to biomedicine. Since they're only in middle school, they're not really sure exactly what branch of science they like. It's our job to let them know what's out there so that they may pursue a pathway when they get to high school. We do a lot of hands-on learning with these kids, and in sixth grade we focus on biodiversity. In seventh grade we move on to life science and genetics, and in eighth grade we cover human body systems. But along with doing that, we do, lose, we do lots of cross-curricular projects as well. So they may go to ELA, and in ELA they're reading a novel on something focusing on genetics or disease transmission. So we are able to get those biomedical concepts into core classes. The seventh grade class is a genetics and heredity course where they learn about DNA, like we did today in our extraction experiment, uh, and its structure and its function, and move on to how heredity works with diseases and genetic uh, defects. Our eighth grade class is based on anatomy and physiology, where the students learn uh, basic anatomy and physiology of the human body. Usually the kids every nine weeks or so have a different book to read, uh, and also a different writing uh, assignment where they're going to write an essay and they'll do individual research. For instance, right now my sixth grade class, uh, which is the biodiversity class, is doing some research on the endangered species of plants, because that's what we've just finished covering in that class. And they're going to move on and work with the paper both in my class for the resources uh, and using science inquiry to answer it, uh, and they're going to do the paper portion in their ELA class. We have very unique uh, chances for professional development and that we're partnered with the Smithsonian. Uh, we also have resources that we pulled in from the Howard Hughes Medical Institute. And we have a great uh, resource in the amount of materials we have to work that are readily here and available for the students to use. So they have tangible materials on site. A program like this is beneficial to the students in the area because the kids are learning really career opportunities and they're learning about what we cover in school and making connection of how this is used in the real world and how it's applicable to more than just one area or aspect. So they're able to be exposed to a little more uh, science than what they would in a normal classroom and it's really an extension of their science class. So they're able to take something that they've learned in their science class, bring into their biomed elective science class and make the connection and go, okay, that's a real world way that we can use that. Uh, the scheduling for the biomedical students is wonderful. I think the students like it. I know we like it. And what we do is we have a team of seventh grade teachers and those students again travel together all day long and they have the same teachers. So again, the students are together and we know their schedule so we know where to go get them if we need them or we know exactly what they're working on in each of their classes. So we can combine our lessons. Parents can call. Parents can meet with all of their teachers at one time. Um, it lets us get to know our students a whole lot better um, because we're able to meet with them as a team with the students, the teachers, and the parents. What sets this school apart from other schools is that I honestly think this school is very well structured compared to other schools and the academics are great, the curriculum is great, the teachers are absolutely awesome. I mean I love the school and especially the academy.